my name is Peter Santoscano, and I am so thrilled about my newest one-person play, Transfigurations, Transgressing Gender in the Bible, a play about transgender Bible characters. Of course, when I mention the play to most people, the response is something like, wait, what? Who? Who's transgender in the Bible? Well, actually, there are a lot of people who would fit under what today we would consider a transgender umbrella. People who are transgressing and transcending gender roles and presentations. I mean, the most obvious, of course, would be the eunuchs. I'm not referring to an operating system here, but people who are transgender in the fact that they have been surgically altered and they are gender different from the others around them. Uh, these were men who were castrated typically before puberty, so they looked and acted and sounded very differently from the men and women around them. They were, I don't know, not male, not female, somewhere in the middle, altogether different. Uh, and so we see them in the Hebrew scriptures, the Christian scriptures. I mean, the book of Esther would fall apart if it wasn't for the eunuchs. And who is the first person we see baptized in the book of Acts? A black transgendered person from Africa, the Ethiopian eunuch. But there are many more than just eunuchs. There are all sorts of folks. And I think you'll find, if you come to my play, that it's not nearly as crazy and provocative as it might sound that uh, the scholarship is there, and these are viable interpretations. So I invite you, come see my play, Transfigurations, Transgressing Gender in the Bible, and discover for yourself who is lurking there on the pages of the Bible.